right guys half fast 719 back at it we'll go ahead and try to attempt something so we got this uh, stall bus I don't know what all that says but it says oil drain valve oh the intelligent way of oil change so basically it's just no mess <clears throat> No clue what any of that says. Um, oh, there's a there's a part number right there. You can look up SB-210411-S-N. And uh, yeah, that's a I don't know what that means. But that's the part number for this one. This is going to be for the uh, the RAM, my drunken RAM. So it comes with a little. Oh, I thought that was a pamphlet. Anyway, it comes with the destructions. Basically says, something, something. I don't know what the heck it's saying. But maybe it's in. Oh, they got all kinds of stuff here. So, yeah. Bring engine oil to operating temperature. Basically, just shows you how to use it. There's 11 steps, no wrenches. That plus that plus that plus that plus that plus that. Um. Anyway, made in Germany. I was trying to buy one. Trying to buy one a couple months ago. So this is the M18 by 1.5, which is this. So I'm going to attempt. So, mind you, I'm going to have my wife here, and she's going to hold the vacuum. Got a shop vac. I was going to use this vacuum, but that's our, that's our fireplace pellet stove vacuum. So, I'm going to use this one because it's more powerful. Basically, I'm going to have my wife holding this right here. Hopefully, she can while I basically take the drain plug out. I'm going to take the drain plug out, and I'm going to swap the new drain plug in. So, that's just a 3 8 inch drive ratchet extension, whatever you want to call it. So, I'll have the camera set up down here while she's pulling the vacuum on it. And I'll have a catch can down there, just in case. Uh, and, uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. I do have some extra oil, hopefully. Yeah, I think I have oil in the barn. So, anyway, let me get you guys set up. Let me get the wife out here. Let me see if she'll come out and help me real quick. I'll have to give her a step stool or something. But anyway, uh, set you guys up under the truck and uh, go from there. So, see how this goes. Now, here we go. guys success it worked sticking a vacuum right here so it could work for a bunch of different things you can see there's no no oil dropped out it's all oil drunk. it's all down in here all good got the cap on no oil leaks <laughs> Mm. So, next, I don't know when I'll do it, probably uh, this weekend, I'll be doing the uh, 
Audi when I change the oil. So I'm going to do the same thing so to show you guys how it works. With the Audi, what I'll do is I'll take, run a vacuum on it, put this piece in there. I'll stick this one on there. And uh, I'll stick this on there, vacuum it, stick it on there, and then do my actual oil change. So here's my old for the Cummins. There's the uh, drain plug for that one. Oh, got all my drain plugs up here. So, anywho, that's pretty much it. So, I'll put a link in the description. I bought this on eBay. I'll try to find it on Amazon and uh, whatever else. But, again, pretty basic, pretty easy little install. Um, because I just did the oil change not too long ago. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. So stay tuned for the Audi, the one for the Audi. I'll be doing that one probably this weekend. Who knows, I might get bored, I might do it today. So again, there's the part number. It's right there, that sb 210 411 sna m18 1.5 thread so i don't know if i can get a good enough picture on here so you guys maybe we could pause it whatever anyway all right guys stay tuned for the next video uh where i'm gonna do the audi um, I'm still going to do some other stuff to the Dodge. And uh, that's pretty much it. Alright guys, stay tuned for the next video. Thanks for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Comment below. Let me know what you guys want to see. What you guys want to do. And as always, if you guys want to send me products for me to review or test out, just contact me. Feel free. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Later.